I wanted to ask you one more question. Yeah, let's do one more question. What do you think about this um, Chelsea Manning situation? Because I, I don't know uh, exactly what happened other than she's in contempt of court. And so they've got her in solitary confinement now. This is about testifying against yeah, WikiLeaks. Yeah, I'll be honest. I haven't been following it that closely. I mean, my, my understanding is that Chelsea Manning, who – okay, so here's where we get Do you call her Bradley? No. You changed he, the name? He changed his name to Chelsea. He is a biological male. <gasps> I can't I believe know. you're misgendering. Are you dead naming as well? Don't no, dead no, name. I, I don't. I don't <laughs> dead name. But uh, unless we're talking about when he committed his crimes, at which point he oh, was okay. actually Bradley as opposed to right. Chelsea, right? So if we're talking about so the person who was convicted, that was a male named Bradley Manning. Did you say if the artist talking about the person, formerly known as Bradley? Yeah, you... <laughs> if we're talking about the human being who's currently in jail, that is a male who is currently known as Chelsea. Mm, so, it, okay. the, so my understanding is that Bradley is that Chelsea Manning is a. Uh, refused to hand over information that he was legally bound to hand over about WikiLeaks. Mm. Uh, and now there were complaints that he's being held in solitary, but that's not true apparently, uh, and that he's being mistreated. I do find it weird that the same people who are complaining about Donald Trump coordinating with WikiLeaks are very upset about Chelsea Manning going to jail for coordinating with WikiLeaks. You're going to need to pick one or the other. Is WikiLeaks bad or is WikiLeaks not bad? Yeah, what is WikiLeaks? It's only dependent upon whether or not they're supporting the narrative that you want that's exactly right and it it's used right to be and that left. wikileaks was very good remember right. it, exactly it was right and left by the way like there are yeah. people on the right where it's like julia Assange, Assange, julian assange is the worst and then 2016 happened like julian assange now there's a person i can really talk to it's like well no i'm pretty sure julian assange is uh, a wikileaks good information suggests they are a russian front group and take make of that what you will. End of story. Do you think that they became a Russian front group to try to stay operative and stay safe because they were obviously being attacked by the United States government and in danger of being shut down? And then they've. I mean, he's. I'll, been I'll be honest. I really don't know enough about WikiLeaks to to, to really get into a. I don't a sort of Historical. But I know that he's been trapped in that embassy for since 2012. Yeah, I mean, I hope that he's got some video games or something in there. Fuck, man. He's been in there for like seven years now, right? That's a long Close. time to be in an embassy. That is a long time. He can't go outside, no sunlight. Pamela Anderson visits every now and then. <laughs> he's fucked, man. I mean, it's, it's a terrible place to be, and I don't know if it's better than prison because it's like the stress of him never knowing when they're going to come knock down the door and pull him out of there. I was like, how, how well does that guy sleep? Yeah. Seven years in that embassy it can't be great can't be great it's got to be awful they took his internet away right uh i think they did that's fucked I mean, to, although to be fair wikileaks was releasing information on specific american soldiers in lines of, of combat so were they yes they didn't redact any of the names that was the problem that's why people were pissed really yes because the, so the original dump from things. chelsea manning was that he dumped all the information to wikileaks including the stuff that was unredacted and ricky leaks just released it they yeah that was, that was the it? claim that was the claim anyway mm, i don't know if that's accurate I I'll heard... if, you, if you find differently, then let me know, because I'll, I'll be happy to correct always. Yeah, you know, I'm sure you would. I just don't know if it, that is, I don't know. I don't have the information in front of me. Do you want to check? No, that'll take too much time. <laughs> that'll t Folks, you're going to have to Google this one. Um, but so when one of the things that I was thinking when Trump got into office with all this drain that swamp shit, I was like, I wonder if Trump would be a WikiLeaks supporter. I wonder if Trump would be happy. Depends. If it helped him, yeah. sure, right? I mean, right. And, or even – and Snowden as well. well you see I was this, wondering you see this, about that. Yeah, I mean, it's the same sort of thing. I mean, unfortunately, politics very often has little to do with principle and everything to do with convenience. Yeah. So if it's helpful, sure. If but not, wouldn't then a guy no. like him who's always anti-deep state and talking about the, the – these – I mean, he's I, I do have extremely a critical. Uh, yes, but I do. I, I have a feeling that one, once you actually sit in the big seat, I think that tends to change. Remember, Obama was too. Yeah. And then five minutes later, he was droning people. So, like, <laughs> <it is> so, <laughs> so 